Good talk, Observer. Um, as you may have, s if you've been following the series, well, if you haven't, my character is now old. He's got moles on his face, and um, I forgot to repair my boats. We went after Montalban Bond, but we were just too old to fight him, which is unfortunate because he's older than I am, so I should have been able to fight him. But, oh well. Let's um, repair the boat. Upgrade hammocks. Actually, let's get rid of this sloop. Yep. Repair this boat. Oops, wrong one. Make sure we have some food, which we do. And sail away. After our fight with Montalban, we lost all of our items, I believe. Is that correct? Yes. But we still have all of our crew. So that's nice. I think this might be the maximum specialist specialists available. And now we're going after... Um, Mendoza because he has my fiance. Well, my future fiance. And now he's coming in at us. But now we just even the odds a little bit. I'm old, so I'm going to go with the rapier. I should have probably went with the cutlass, but oh well. Well, as long as he keeps making this easy for me, um, we'll be okay. Okay, I gotta beat him, because my crew can't fight him. Up the stairs, boy. Come on. Haha. <laughs> Unipa. That's what he said. I don't think that says anything, but it sounds French. You're a master swordsman, sir. The governor's daughter is held hostage in the forecastle. Welcome, darling. I dreamt every night that you'd come to rescue me. Let us return to my father in Morocco. Welcome aboard, lads. We lost a lot of men in that battle. Sinker. Okay. We might... I don't... I don't know if we can... If we stand a chance against, um, Montalban. Okay. I have an amazing story to tell you, my love. While I was held captive, legendary lost city of the Incas. I trust it to you for safekeeping. Oh, yeah. That is nice. <laughs> we don't even need the other pieces. This is the perfect piece. <laughs> The only piece of note noteworthiness. Villa Hermosa. Let's all go that way. <laughs> okay, so I believe when Duke Ofstein Rittenbrand returns, he will have a very important question to ask you. <laughs> okay, so. Increase my acres 150. <laughs> Sir, I ask your daughter's hand in marriage. <laughs> Luckiest woman in the Western Hemisphere. Apparently, she thinks somebody is better than me. I now pronounce you man and wife. Says the monk. Now, ladies, if there are any ladies watching my Let's Play, um, this green and orange outfit here, amazing color. I, I mean, I, I absolutely love it on my eyes. Anyway, 
Let's visit the tavern, get some men. I don't have any need for that. Not now, anyway. We can take that. He's headed in the direction of Santo Domingo. Okay. Well. That's nice. Let's get this ship out of the way. You don't want to do that, son. There you go. Tons of money. Sinker. Well, we're right next to port, so we'll take all. Keep her. Attack this trade galleon. Who already has wounded sails. Make them give up. Okay. Take all. Keep all. Now this is pretty much... We have this to do. We can go around gaining our money. Upgrade the boat. Upgrade the boat. Sell the boat. One second, so no, I need to divide. We'll sell everything. That was not that as awesome as I was hoping it would be. Sell it. Sell it. Yes, I'm sure. Okay, for a second there, I was afraid we um, repair it. Sold our own ship. Trade merchant, we need food. Forget guns. Oh, he's out of money. Buy food. It shouldn't take us more than a year to get up there. If it does, we have issues. Transporting immigrants. We had an invasion force go out here earlier. Did it attack anything? Ah, they got Kumana back. We might have to fix that later. But for now, we have a lost city to discover. <laughs> I'm so mad that we couldn't defeat that guy. <laughs> Ooh, a treasure ship. Don't worry. You're okay. So, luckily, um, I do not rely on fencing to win my battles. I rely on gunnery. So I'm able to continue playing for at least a little while longer, um, whereas if you don't learn how to shoot your cannons or make ships surrender, um, you can't really go much further um, once you're old. And I'm hoping that if I get some medicine, some, er some herbs, well, herbal medicines, um, I'll be able to add another five years to my character's life, hopefully. Um, I really should have taken that medicine since I was doing a let's play. But, um, oh well. Now, it's probably going to be a while before we find this city. Because we have nothing to go on except there's an Ica temple, an arch, rock, and a stone head. We don't know. It could actually be anywhere, <laughs> to be honest. But that's not going to stop me from trying. 
I'm actually going to start right here. Make our way over. The reason for this is so we don't have to travel a stupendous amount. For one. Well, by boat. Let's see. Usually these cities are way inland anyway, so going up right up the port is not the best idea. I believe if we keep going forward, we'll eventually land, we'll discover that one port. I actually should have brought some more food. This is going to be problematic. Okay. So you notice there's absolutely nothing here. Like... No, there's a geyser. Like, that's how we know that we're g coming across something. Is that there's generally nothing unless there's something around. So now we're at the town. Do we have a geyser on the map? We do have a geyser. Oh, that's Lafayette's treasure. We don't have a geyser. We have totem pole, Ica temple. That's what I gotta look for. It's around this town. Let me double check that we're at the right town. For one. Okay, we're not at the right town. But we're close. Actually, let's get some food while we're here. Talk to the abbot. He's all the way over there. That's nice to know. Trade with the abbot. Give me some food, bro. Okay. So we need to head in this direction. We have dead trees. More dead trees. So let's go over this way. This might be a fool's errand. In all honesty. can't see anything a geyser we should be approaching the port unless we've already missed it Something over here. Dead trees. What's that? Ah, oh, trees. We have dead trees. Geyser.
one guy, so let's find the water again. Found another geyser. Hmm. There's another geyser. It's starting to look decent. Third geyser. A Indian tower. Another geyser over here. There it is. Okay. Ha 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 ha. And you doubted me. A thorough search of the legendary lost city of the Incas reveals treasure worth over 50,000 gold pieces. Yes. Return to the boat. Okay, let's get some food. And start hunting down, um, Romando again to find our uncle. Oh, sail away. Sail away. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, that was close. <laughs> We need some food. Come on, Lost Harbor. Give us some food. There's pet talks. Not interested. The Adventure Prize. I don't really care. Okay. Merchant, give me some food. Oh man, there's a major storm outside my apartment right now. And that sounds amazing. <laughs> um, yeah. I really, um, I grew up on kind of a, kind of a farm. So, rain... It was a happy time for me. We used to go out and run in the rain and stuff like that. Of course, I, I'm sure most kids do. But, I mean, we actually liked the rain because it meant our crops would be better. Oh, hello. Can we take this guy? I've never met him before. if we can't we should at least damage his boat well damage his crew to the point that he can't fight us <laughs> just in case um, we have issues where I can't fight Okay, he surrendered, but that means absolutely nothing. <laughs> um, I'm going to continue bombarding him. I'm killing his crew as much as I can. <laughs> Because my old bones won't be able to take anything else. Okay, that should be good enough. Maybe one more barrage. There we go. <laughs> if he doesn't surrender now, I don't think he ever will. Wow. 
Okay. Now we're in luck. Now we're getting to the point where we have enough gold. We have as half as much gold as we need to do pretty much anything. Um, let's get a lot of this food. That's all I care about. Um, if you have enough gold, you can stay out on the open sea indefinitely. And um, so we're going to try. And if you're able to stay out at sea, you don't age. Well, you do age, but I mean... Um, you'll basically survive it, I guess. That's what I'm trying to say. Well, if you're out at sea, you don't have to divide the plunder if you're able to stay out there. And um, if you get so old, eventually you won't be able to divide the plunder. You'll just be given the option to retire. So, what we're going to do now is one... We're going to get more gold, as much gold as possible, and we're going to try to find medicine. I mean, that's the most we can do right now, and hopefully this medicine will help us fight again so we can fight uh, Montauban. And I don't think it's going to let me revert to adventure um, difficulty. But if it did, it would be cool, because then I might actually have the chance to, uh, I mean, to apprentice difficulty. Because if it did, then we might actually stand a chance against um, Montauban. I actually need a, f a lot more men. So I'm going to go to um, Nombre de Dios here. We might eventually go back after uh, Cumana as well. Retake that port. Trade Galleon. But yeah, this age factor, it really adds an interesting dynamic to the game. Let's uh, go after this guy. Oh, okay. That's good. Um, because it kind of forces replayability. I mean, good games, you want to replay them over and over and over again, and you have other things to do. Um, and in this game, it almost makes it so that you can't do everything all at once. And that's... That's a good thing. Oh my goodness. You can continue hitting us. I'll survive. Don't worry. There we go. Come on. Thank you. Welcome aboard, lads. Take all. Keeper. And then we're going to go after you next. Why are you being so mean to me? Okay, they've given up. Welcome aboard, lads. Take all. We gotta wait out here for a moment. Let this um, new governor arrive so that we get better deals. Wealthy Dutch trading post. Nothing happened. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Yeah, he's not interested. Let's get some more men. When is love? 
but I don't think I'm able to fight that guy. Eight. Detour. Okay, so we're gonna get some good money off of this. Awesome. Let's talk to the governor. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe next time. Okay, so I think this is a good point to stop this. Um, let's play. Did we go to the tavern? Yeah. Okay. So this is a good point to stop this episode. So in the next episode, um, we're gonna try to go after Romando again, and I really don't know where he is. But we'll find him. Don't worry. Um, we also might go back to Kumana and get our port back. If we can get enough men. And continue our gold-seeking adventure. Um, I'm probably going to turn into... Um, almost a full-fledged pirate here in a minute. Probably. I don't know. Um, uh, my guy's getting pretty old. Um, the only way I can survive now is to hoard a ton of money and keep my men from mutinying against me so this might be an interesting dynamic dynamic will Ulfstein Rembrandt abandon the Dutch will the Netherlands and go full rogue or what will he do I don't know well we'll see and then as we continue this let's play of Sid Meier's Pirates I'll feed a Zane